and it's Gidu, and in this video I'm going to be giving you guys a closer look at the Makise Kurusu figure from Good Smell Company. She's a 1 8 figure. I did an unboxing of her. I will link that in the description below. We'll do a quick 360 of her so you can take a look. She did come with two bases. If you want to see what the other base looks like, there's a little fluff on here. Um, take a look at the unboxing. And this one is the one that I chose to put her on just because I thought it made it look a little more complete. The other base is just a white circle base that has the title Steins Gate on it. But this one here just looks more scenic, I guess. <laughs> makes it a scene, if that makes sense. So that was a quick 360. And you might occasionally see me up here because my filming thing is different than it was before. So we'll see how this works. But this is how she is. If you guys do have any questions or suggestions on better ways to film this, please let me know. I will try to do some of the things that you suggest as long as it is in my ability to with the setup that I have. So, so far the paint job is really good. I've only noticed some spots on the stripes here at the end of her coat. Like right there and I think there was another one somewhere. Some of the strips, yeah, you can kind of see that they're a little uneven. Um, but that is pretty minor. Not super noticeable, so it doesn't really bother me. It is just something to note that, of course, there's going to be a few things like that on any figure. Nothing's perfect. And I think there was some spots on her belt as well. Oh, there's a little star on her belt bubble. That's cute. Yeah, you can see a bit of paint smudge on there. She has no butt. None. Very small. Sorry, keeps losing focus because she's moving around. Um, I like her tights. I like the way they made them look. Although I feel like they could have made them look a little more... Like, I don't know. A, a different tone to make it a look a little more like their skin underneath. If that makes sense. It's not bad though. But that's pretty much that. We've got her boots. I think her boots are super cute. I like those little folded down style boots. Adorable. She's just on the base right there. There's pegs underneath her foot. Here is the base itself. Just some stairs, a little bit of metallic detailing. Nothing on the back. Oh, you can see there's a little bit of separation there. I didn't notice that before. Um, nothing I can really do about that, though. Um, just a really quick video kind of showing you guys what her figure looks like as a whole. Um, I'll let you take a look at her hands really quick because I feel like that's kind of important. Um, her hands are okay. I don't really see... They didn't really... Like, they gave her nails a bit of a tint, but they're not painted shiny or anything, so nothing too too special but i guess she is also an older figure design so they might not have done that in the past i mean there's a little something but the other hand didn't look like it that one finger looks kind of painted but yeah so far i'm quite happy with her her like half off shoulder jacket is quite cute don't really understand it feel like it'd kind of mess up your movement you know and the way <laughs> the way the sleeve is bent down here makes it look like her arm is really bent and curved in an odd direction <laughs> I, I know it, it's like not right but if you can kind of see what I mean by just the way the jacket itself curves but no like I'm really happy with her she's really cute quite enjoying this figure again there is a version with a lab coat um, and like, I believe slippers. I think she might be also holding like a Dr. Pepper or something. But, yeah. I like her face a lot. I think she turned out very nice. I missed these in the box when I was doing, I'm doing the closer look right now. And I'm sitting here looking, I'm like, I feel like something's missing from her hand. And I was like, I'm pretty sure she's supposed to have a cell phone. Did this figure not come with a cell phone? Um, long story short, 
I'm dumb. The cell phone was in the box. Uh, you probably noticed it in the unboxing and I just didn't take it out because I'm stupid and didn't see it. Um, and this is the little, what are they called? Oompas? I'm like Oompa Loompa. Um, what, what the fuck are these things called? I, I can't remember, honestly, but an Oompa-like thing. It's like a little panda or whatever, but like this one's a metal one from it's from the show you'll get it if you've seen the show but yeah that I, I don't know where you'd put that or if she can even hold that but the phone is definitely gonna okay, go on your hand. that's her with the phone the phone's actually quite detailed i am i am satisfied with it it's pretty cool there's some detailing on the back of the phone as well but this is it i love how it's not focusing please focus that is the phone there uh, ba, ba, ba. I'll show you like the back of the phone. There's a little bit of detailing there. But yeah, so that's her with the phone. Cool, cool. I'm dumb. Please ignore me. <laughs> Hope I fix this. I'm not going to put this with the figure displayed because I don't want to lose it. And the only place I can think to put it is just like on the base at the moment because her other hand is clasped closed. So it's definitely not holding the Oompa Loompa thing. What are they called? You know what? Someone's going to comment and I'm going to be like, I <laughs> know I remember. <laughs> Anyways, thank you so much for watching. I apologize for being a complete dumbass. Um, this was the closer look of Makise Kurusu's 1-8 figure. I'll link her unboxing in the description below. Again, I forgot that these were in the, that these were in the box because I'm stupid. Anyways, I'll link my social media and my favorite links through this, through in blah, 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 see Japan and Tokyo talk mode. If you purchase anything through those links, thank you, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I get a small commission when you do. So like thank you to those of you who've done it before. Um it, it always is it's so nice to know that people like actually wanna do something like that. It's it's really sweet. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Link everything in the description below. Check those out and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.